The competition was fierce as teams of high school students battled in the VEX Robotics competition held before the All-American Bowl in San Antonio, Texas, January 4th. The U.S. Army sponsored the competition held in conjunction with the technology displays set up in the Army Strong Zone. Students built and programmed the robots to compete in challenges on a set course, earning points for how well their robots completed the tasks. One of the teams represented Galena Park High School from Galena, Texas. This is my second year in robotics, but I've always had a passion for learning how things worked and how they are built on the inside. So I, whenever I found out we had, our school had a robotics club, I was very very eager to join. She said she's been interested in engineering since she was very young. I would say since I was about six or seven, whenever you start learning, oh, well, if you put this and this together, it makes this. So whenever I started figuring that out, that's when I started getting more curious about how things worked. Her teammate agreed. I have been interested in STEM careers since I was in about fifth grade. But it was until my sophomore year that I joined the robotics team and was interested in mechanical engineering. U.S. Army Research Development and Engineering Command Director Dale Orman was the final speaker at the competition's awards ceremony, and he told them he was very impressed. Let me congratulate those students who stepped onto the field of battle, and it was a battle. I mean, I'll tell you what, the last couple of rounds, it was, it was pretty brutal out there. I'm surprised your machine survived. I encourage you to persevere in the STEM degrees, and it is about perseverance. What you did today showed your perseverance. Foreman went on to tell the students there are many opportunities in the STEM fields to be the creative force behind today's soldiers. For Army Technology Live, I'm Dennis Neal.